Hi you all, so today we're looking at the line of Snow and Ely axes we sell. And Snow and Ely goes way back to 1864. They are an old American brand. And then I guess in the mid 90s, they, in the mid 1900s, they sort of devalued the brand, went to China or whatever. And then the Amish bought the brand and brought it back to the USA. They're all 100% made in the USA, US hickory handles. And a lot of people are falling back in love with them. They're awesome axis. So we'll start from the smallest to the longest. And here's the outdoors men's belt axe. You have a sheath with a nice belt loop there that you can stick on your belt and pull it in and out while it's still on your belt. And overall, a lot of the bigger axe sheaths on the Snow and Ely, I would say are the weak point probably. Um, they have great steel, US Hickory handles. The other one downside is they usually need just a little bit of sharpening when you get them. They're not quite ready to use out of the box, but a lot of people don't really mind that. You're gonna have to sharpen your axe eventually anyway. So let me see, the head weight on this is 1.4 pounds and the handle length is 14 and a half inches. So a great little hatchet there. So we'll go up to the Penebscot. This is a very popular one of those. And this is basically a Hudson Bay head design. It's the same as the Hudson Bay. They're both, let me see there, one and three quarter pounds. Pretty much the exact same head. I'll get this one down. Just a shorter handle on the Penebscot. And of course the Hudson Bay is a classic American, um, North American design. A lot of people like it. So the handle on this is 17 inches on the Penebscot. And on the Hudson Bay, it is 23 and a half inches. So we'll move up here to the our best axe. And let me see the weight on this. It's our best 2.4 pound head. So we'll look down here, 28 inch handle. Nice light head with a long handle if you're, that's, I like that for pack axis. You don't have to carry as much weight, but you're able to get a lot of the strengthen your swing and then we'll move up here to the our best three and a half pound axe so i actually haven't taken the sheath off of one of these so here's a nice little felon axe and like i said the head weight is three and a half pounds the handle length is 29 inches so one thing about amish is they still live like they did in the 1800s. They use axes every day. They really know what they're doing with axes. So, I mean, I pretty much trust these are gonna be pretty awesome axes. Um, a lot of people love the steel they're made out of. Some great stuff, 100% made in the USA. And I'm not sure exactly how they make them, but I have noticed the different um, batches, the blades will vary in width a little bit. So I'm assuming they are semi handmade, even though they're probably more of a drop forged than a hand forged but a pretty awesome line and very soon in the future once we get a couple more of our axes in stock we do hope to do an all usa um, hatchet video so we're very proud to have this god bless you and thank you for watching